It has been more than a week since that massive explosion at the Sandman Signature Hotel in downtown Fort Worth. And now this morning, we are hearing those 911 calls for the very first time. Cleo Green is with us in studio to walk us through what we're hearing. And Cleo, the audio on these calls shows just how terrifying that experience was. Yeah, Mark, and you know, it provides new details and a different perspective as to what that day truly was like eight days ago as we comb through those 911 calls. This is actually one of the most clicked on stories on our website and one of the first audio clips that we hear from it is from a woman that's stuck in the elevator. Take a listen. Sandman Hotel, we're stuck in an elevator filled with smoke. Fire. It's okay. on fire. Are you at the convention oh, center? No, we're at the hotel. What? The party. Fire department. Yo, there's a big explosion here at the Sandman Hotel, 8th in Houston. An explosion? Yeah, something exploded. As you can imagine, such a scary moment, right? People uh, downtown heard that explosion also calling 911. Now, during the investigation, Atmos, well, they determined its systems did not cause that blast. As the lead investigating agency, Fort Worth Fire Chief Jim Davis, says they're using resources from multiple agencies, including the ATF. He expects the investigation could take up to six months. Right now, they say that building is sturdy. Chief Davis also said that they're still recovering evidence from the scene. Once again, this is one of our most clicked on stories this morning, and you can really dive into those calls and read more about the investigation as well. I'll send it back to you, Mark. All right. Thank you for that update this morning.